Imagine if you could control devices with just your thoughts. Sounds like science fiction, right? Picture a world where your mind is the ultimate remote control. No need for buttons, touchscreens, or voice commands. Your thoughts alone could command the technology around you. This isn't just a far-fetched concept from the realms of Star Wars or Black Mirror. It's the intriguing world of thought-controlled technology, a burgeoning field that promises to revolutionize the way we interact with our environment. It's the realm where the human brain melds with artificial intelligence, breaking down the barriers between man and machine. From controlling prosthetic limbs to flying drones, from typing messages to changing TV channels, the possibilities are as limitless as the human imagination itself. And the most exciting part? This isn't just a distant dream or a concept from a sci-fi movie. It's an emerging reality, a tantalizing glimpse into a future shaped by the power of our minds. But what if I told you this isn't just a concept from a sci-fi movie? It's actually closer to reality than you might think. Enter the world of brain-computer interfaces, or BCIs. These fascinating devices form a direct communication pathway between our brain's electrical activity and an external device, such as a computer or a robotic limb. Imagine the limitless possibilities that this opens up. The origins of BCI research trace back to the 1970s, with Jacques Vidal at UCLA being a key figure in the field. The foundation for BCI development, however, was laid much earlier in 1924, with Hans Berger's discovery of EEG or electroencephalography. This is a method to record electrical activity of the brain, and it's at the heart of how BCIs function. Over the decades, BCIs have evolved from non-invasive to invasive methods, each with its advantages and challenges. From restoring sensory motor functions to enhancing cognitive abilities, the applications of BCIs are as diverse as they are transformative. Key organizations and companies have been at the forefront of BCI research and development. One such company is Neuralink, co-founded by Elon Musk, which is pioneering high bandwidth, minimally invasive BCIs. As we speak, machine learning algorithms are being trained to successfully classify mental states, making BCI communication more sophisticated and precise. Neuroprosthetics are another exciting area of BCI application, aiming to restore functions like sight, hearing, and movement, and we've already seen experimental success in both animals and humans. BCIs are not just a concept anymore. They are a rapidly evolving technology with the potential to revolutionize our lives. Our current technology, as advanced as it is, still has its limitations. Take a moment to consider our interaction with technology. It's predominantly manual, isn't it? We type, we click, we swipe. It's a physical interaction that requires effort, and more importantly, time. This leads to a significant delay between our thoughts and the actions our devices perform. For some, this interaction is even more challenging due to physical disabilities creating a barrier to the digital world. Then, there's the issue of efficiency. We're limited by the speed at which we can input commands and the complexity of tasks we can perform is restricted by the interfaces available. Imagine trying to compose a symphony using just a mouse and keyboard. It's not impossible, but it's certainly not ideal. And let's not forget the disconnect in our current human-computer interaction. While our devices can perform complex tasks, they don't truly understand us. They don't perceive our emotions, our intentions, or our thoughts. Brain-Computer Interfaces, or BCIs, promise to address these limitations. They aim to create a direct link between our minds and our machines, bypassing physical interaction and creating a truly intuitive connection. BCIs hold the key to overcoming these hurdles and unlocking a new era of technological advancement. But how exactly will BCIs change our society? Let's break it down. Firstly, in the medical field, BCIs are a beacon of hope. They offer a way to restore or even augment human abilities. Imagine those who've lost the ability to walk due to spinal cord injuries being able to move again, all thanks to a BCI linking their brain to a robotic limb. Or consider the implications for people with neurodegenerative disorders. BCIs could potentially give them back their independence, allowing them to communicate and interact with the world around them in ways that were once impossible. Imagine a world where communication doesn't rely solely on spoken or written words. With BCIs, it could be as simple as thinking a thought and having it understood by another person or a machine. This could revolutionize not only how we interact with each other, but also with the technology around us. Now let's shift gears and talk about entertainment. Think about the world of gaming. BCIs could take virtual reality to a whole new level. 
You wouldn't just control a character on a screen, you'd be the character, experiencing the game world as if it were real. But what's the proof that all this isn't just pie-in-the-sky thinking? Well, a recent advancement showcases the immense potential of BCIs. Neuralink, a company founded by Elon Musk, has successfully implanted a BCI in a monkey, which was then able to control a computer game using only its thoughts. This remarkable achievement is a sign of what's to come. The impact of BCIs goes beyond just convenience. They have the potential to redefine human-computer interaction and enhance accessibility like never before. The future is not as far off as we might think. Imagine a world where your thoughts can control devices directly, where the line between man and machine blurs into a harmonious synergy. That's the world brain-computer interfaces, or BCIs, are paving the way for. The impact of BCIs on society is immeasurable. They hold the potential to revolutionize several sectors, from healthcare to entertainment and everything in between. Picture a world where the visually impaired regain their sight, where the paralyzed regain their mobility, all through the power of BCIs. It's not just about restoring function. It's about augmenting human capabilities beyond our wildest dreams. In communication, BCIs could transcend language barriers, enabling us to convey thoughts and ideas directly. In gaming, they could provide an immersive experience like no other, where players control the game with their minds. But perhaps the most profound impact of BCIs lies within each individual. They offer a means to overcome personal limitations, to enhance one's abilities, to be more than what nature intended. They promise a future where the only limit is the human imagination itself. BCIs are not just a futuristic concept, they're a reality that's closer than we think. The question is, are we ready to embrace this change?